he instructed, knowing that it was a crime, and he instructed that the body be moved or the body be buried or anything, knowing that it was a crime. I don't believe he knew, but if he knows it was a crime at that point, then he's guilty of a crime too. Or, yeah, I, mean, I can't say he's guilty, yes. I mean, he can be charged for something, then he can now, he can now get a lawyer to defend him on that. No, that's, that's, okay. let me, wait, let me, no, 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 rest please wait, please wait. Please wait. Not that, let, it become an let, me a, let me ask a question, let off TikTok. Yeah. Baba moving that body, okay? Yeah. You have, an, you, you should have, a, you should know better what is a crime more than Baba. Baba moving that body from yeah. that house in an ambulance yeah. to the police station. From yeah. your own intelligence and your understanding of law, what yeah. crime has he committed? And why did police not detect the crime? Go back, go, go on. Under the section 48 of the Corona System Law. Yes. Disposing, disposal of a body where sorry, you sorry, are no, please, report. Again, again, you did not come back. Let me take you back again. Section 48, okay, talks about the, the, the only area you can pick there is burial. But my own question is this, moving that body until police station, what crime has it committed? Has it committed any crime and tell me the name of that crime? Moving that money home to that police station. And what he thought, you are not getting it. The crime he committed will be dependent on his intent. Intention is, when the law is looking at a crime, intention is a very key part of it. So if at that point. What, what, had, what, what intention can you deduce from what hold he on, did? Because hold on. The corpse was he, moved on ambulance. On, and ambulance on, has a license on, to move dead bodies. Good exit, hold on. If Baba, according to him, believed his son has been killed, the word killed, if he believed and he moved that body, it's an accessory after the fact because he tampered with evidence because he believed the son has been killed. He should not have moved the body. If truly he believed the son with what killed. evidence? Sorry? Tampered with what evidence? The body is his evidence itself. What are you talking about, Papa Yano? Yeah, okay, please, has been sorry, sorry, sorry. sorry. Is when you say tampered with evidence, when it, when there is tamp tampering with evidence, okay, I yeah. think it has to do with order or like to um, alter any change. Did moving that body in an ambulance from home to the police did that alter any change moving in that body? The body in the po uh, moving the body, the position of the body, all these things are they are an integral part of determining how the body, how the person was killed. At okay, what now, point the person okay, was okay, killed? Now, all these things are part of okay. it. Okay, now does that amount? Does that mean that moving the body from the hospital to home does that amount to the same thing, or it only yes, amount? If they feel, I mean, yes, if they feel it was a crime, that's what I'm telling you. That mm -hmm. if you think a crime has been done and you mm -hmm. now move the body, then you have tampered with the evidence because you know it was a crime that you you okay. believe it was not, a crime. They, they don't think a crime has committed. They, they, they don't think, think a crime they have, committed. They feel, not a crime. I'm not gonna so I'm not gonna be here to defend them, but no, no, I do that no, no see, wait, wait, let me have TikTok, please. When you're speaking to me, okay, defend to whatever level that you can. I, I'm dealing with your intelligence. Go, can you whether you whatever you understand? Do whatever well, no, you can. We, we, we understand I'm you're trying to defend the criminals. So just, we okay, please don't involve, don't get involved, okay? okay? So please do use whatever skills you've got. You come into I'm gonna try to ask you to pin you somewhere. Mm -hmm. There's no it's excuse. Fine. Defend to whatever yes, extent that you can. Yeah. What I'm saying is this: after the body has been certified dead in the hospital, yeah, then moving that body from hospital to home is it tampering with evidence? No. If they don't believe, if the police eventually discovered it was a crime, then they can charge them for uh, tampering with the evidence. But if they don't believe at that point that a crime has been committed then they have not tampered wait, wait, wait. with any evidence is, let's say you want to, you want to charge them for tampering with evidence what are the evidence you'll be looking for that are tampered with because you have to i mean you have to start if i want to charge you if i want to charge you the family at home or, moving or the, the body from hospital back home wait moving the body from hospital back home tell me the kind of tampering which you can enlist out and if, those that, and if, those that the, will be if the guy was truly killed 
and they move the body and they knew and they move the body back home then it is possible maybe they have done something to the body on the way it's possible they have tried to cover up some um I, would do the, I want to know what is that something you don't just go to court and that's say that's what i'm saying depending what on what the crime is for yeah. example what is that thing you know, hold on hold on for example mama if it turns for. out mm. hold on for example mm. if it turns out mm. mobile died out of a stab wound then they could have tampered with the evidence by trying to uh cover up the the openings on his body if it was discovered that that was what he died of okay, or if what, it was discovered okay no that is soon for you to that's something I'm, I'm trying to catch you somewhere for you to be able to uh, establish your tampering with evidence you have to be able to prove it from the body of the deceased right you first you have to know what the crime is once uh, you know the crime, how you know, know what the evidence is. is when you don't know the cause. Okay, I want if to you ask don't something. Know what the crime is, you don't know what the evidence is. Are. Okay, wait, wait, wait. How you do you charge somebody for murder you know? when there's no body? Oh, please, wait, body wait, is wait. a key. Body Take is a key evidence in bro, murder. Wait, bro, wait, 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 wait. I'm saying, how do you charge somebody when you don't know their cause? You don't know the causation. You don't know what they have done, but you're just charging them. Does that? that, that is, how, uh, but Pariana, I think that's what I've been saying since that you need to know what the crime is first before you can now say they have tampered with evidence because oh. evidence mm. depends exactly. On so that's what I'm saying. The Baba has not tampered with any evidence. Can no, we establish a Baba particular says, thing? Oh, mm -hmm. I'm saying by Baba's own admission, he said he knew his boy has been killed based on all the things he said. He went upstairs, he saw blood, and he believed, okay, let's go, go to the station, let everybody be arrested, and let us let everything be sorted out. He knew, he, he already knew, he already made up his mind that this is a crime. That let, me something, um, let me tell something, let me tell something. So let if, me tell something. What I would have considered tampering with evidence. Uh, let us say that Mubad, okay, before he was moved out of that house, he was preserved, okay? Like he was um, embalmed in that particular house, one. Or let me say one of his kidney was removed. Okay, now they now take him to the um, hospital. Upon investigation, if a police officer detects such, first I will have to detect what they have done, then I will now interpret it that because of this one, that this one means tampering with evidence. Do you agree to that? No, not it doesn't just cover that. Tampering with evidence is uh, is very wide. It I know, be, but is this part of it? Is it this is this is this as removing, as removing a strand of hair from the disease. It could be exactly. as like that. Exactly. But it, the, you have to prove it before you establish the tampering of evi with evidence, right? Yes, you have to okay. prove this. So, yeah, so I'm asking you, like, what proof? Okay. Tell me, like, what kind of a proof you now? Let me say you are the police officer. You want to establish a of tamper with evidence from moving that body from a house to the hospital. What proof will you be looking for? Go on. Between whom and, and from whom to the police station? Until we know what the crime is. Is the boy, has the boy been killed? Is he a murder? If, the, if it's a murder, if it is murder, no. then... Sorry, what did you say? I said from whom to the hospital from whom to the police station let's say you want to detect the crime from home to the police station or from home to the hospital from police from home to the host to the police station from home to police station what tamper what what type of tam because tampering of evidence is white like you said so what kind of tampering of every with evidence can you deduce out that must have happened in this particular um situation no, it is, we, cannot, we, know, we are talking hypothetically now because in this particular situation we don't know if a crime has been done there we don't know yet it's only baba that is telling us the boy was killed at all okay, okay now look at the thing here let's say know, they come can, to your can police. I ask him a question no no wait wait wait, wait. Uh, quick one they come to your police station don't you think it was your duty as a police to try to find out whether a crime has been committed or they have to tell you before you do it. Go on, lawyer. It is. It is. It is part of the police duty to find out. Uh, how do they do that? Is by questioning. Is by using their skills and their training. Okay. And if they have okay. questioned now, Baba, now, wait, wait, wait. Baba you, a statement, you and, they, and they have reasonable and they have reasonable excuse to believe nothing mm -hmm. wrong has been done or no crime has been done. Mm -hmm. Then until you have something, a superior evidence mm -hmm. to 
to pin them. That's why you cannot tell them they've not done their now, job. On what is right now in this case of the police? The police should have given them a police report if nothing was detected. And if something was detected, they should have detained them. True or false? Do you agree with that? If something was detected, they should have been detained. If nothing was detected, they could still refer them back to or another police station if i don't know what their rules are because mm -hmm. all these uh, authorities all mm -hmm. these organizations they have their own no. internal rules no no, no. They, do, no. They, do. they do they do they have their own procedures they I mean, have that's their own just with the police regulatory act i Sorry? just i said the police have act we have the police act you know, so no right. apart from the act that is general to the government they have rules of engagement just, just leave that if I we are think, saying i don't that. think i don't think the man can answer all these questions you are asking there is no are, question you are asking that i can't answer hello hello sir he has asked you that you said evidence being tampered with and a corpse being taken to police station either hmm. for either to butcher the Cops. No, no. Do, actually, do you think it is right if you see a crime that has been done, you pick up the body and take it to a police station? Sir, it's it's to the knowledge of how I'm, I think I can handle it. It's the police that will put it in the right perspective. No, either no. I, I'm actually oh, no. putting you on the spot I now. Be I'm oh, putting no, you on the oh, spot. No, you think if you feel, oh, if you no. see someone killed on the road, you pick up their body and you go straight to the police station? If, if I think I'm helping this society, then let me be culpable for whatever offense they're going to interpret it on no, me. No, no, no. You're, you're, you're not being sincere with yourself. You're not being sincere with yourself. Can I ask the uh, lawyer of, of, the, of the law? No, uh, you're no, not being sincere okay, with yourself. Yeah, I'm coming. I want to bring, I want to bring that law for you. Okay? Go on, Aristocrat. Okay. Let me bring that law for him. Go on. Lawyer on TikTok. I yes, Aristocrat. I want us to be on the same plane. Okay. With your understanding of this Mubaz case. Okay. Now the argument was this, so that because for me I don't want us to move about. The argument was this: some section of people believe Baba is guilty of tampering with evidence by authorizing that the body of Mubad be moved by an ambulance. Now, my point is this: while you can establish tampering with evidence, let's play back. Because to their own knowledge, it's only Baba that tampered with evidence. Mm. Let us play back. In this matter, some set of people took his body to the hospital. When they got to the hospital, the hospital told them he is dead. They took the body again. And when they told them he, he was dead, they should have okay, deposited there and took the process to uh, take him to the to the morgue whatever you want to do but they took from there to another hospital hmm? after mm -hmm. they've been told he's dead took him to another hospital the hospital told them he's dead they brought him back to the same hospital now to get uh certificates and all that they now took him back home when they mm -hmm. got home they cleaned I took him that. up sorry can i stop you there I think well, you added a line there that they took okay. him back to the same hospital that day no, to no, get the okay. certificates. Okay, no, 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 no. They didn't take you to the same hospital. They took him back home after two hospitals have confirmed him dead. You understand now? They took him back home, cleaned him up. They cleaned him up. Yeah. Dressed him up and put cutting wood, whatever, whatever the Baba said they put on his body. Baba was not there then. Baba came after and he got to the house maybe by consensus or a unilateral decision as his position he ordered someone to call an ambulance to move the body now that is where the argument came that Baba authorizing whether he touched it or not he authorized it so Baba authorizing that the body be moved by ambulance Baba should be charged for tampering with evidence with the scenes that I've narrated to you hmm. from a legal aspect. Yeah. Um, no, you are not defending anybody. You just want to educate us. Yeah. Who and who in this story and understanding the motive of Baba 
You understand what I mean? Yeah. Understanding the motive of every other person. Mm. Understanding the motive that even Baba forced himself to that sin because he was not explicitly, clearly told that the guy was dead. He only went there as a parent that feel that had an hunch to say something was wrong. I believe he's not even thinking the boy was dead when he rushed there. Probably something was wrong. They just don't want to tell me before he found out what happened. Now, as an impartial, legal-minded person, who, what would you advise? And pinpoint who or those who might be charged with tampering with evidence. As brief as you can. Yeah, I will give you the short answer. The short answer is, if a crime were to be established today now, with everybody that moved the body, depending on the crime that was established, because if they can only establish a crime of a nurse practicing without license, then the body might not be a critical evidence where you can now charge somebody with tampering with evidence. Number but one. if the crime is uh, murder, manslaughter, things like that, then the body itself becomes a critical evidence in that case. Number two. So in that case, anybody that has been involved in the <coughs> moving, changing the position and all that of the cops during that period after the death, before the police intervened, they could all be charged with tampering with evidence depending on the degree of their involvement in all those things. Thank you very much. I think you've answered the question. And I think this to lay things to rest. And this has been my position. Nobody can say it is only Baba if you want to use the angle of tampering with evidence. Exactly. Is, nobody can only say only Baba. Everybody that touched that body will be charged. Now, but we all know as a fact that our almighty police, from their charge statement, are not looking at Moba's body as an exhibit. They are looking exactly. at the if, are the actions of some character that led to his death. So, thank you very much because I don't want us, I don't want anybody to put you under anything. Now, for those who always come up here to cry wolves, I believe we can all think around this thing. It's a very simple thing. If police, in their magnanimity, are uh, investigating, never refer to that body as an SCB then they wouldn't have gone to the area of charging anybody. But even yeah. if they did, even if they did, everyone that touched that body, if they want to charge people, whether you are ignorant of the law or not, ignorance of the law is no excuse. Everyone that have touched the body after the body was confirmed or whatever, whatever, is guilty. Yes, so I'm if, uh, aristocrat. Sorry, let me you. come in. Aristocrat, can I, can, I come, can I ask you a question? Can... Um, Considering the considering the fact that Baba got there and he met so many people there, can he use the defense that he had fear of him, his life or he was afraid? That's why he had to go to the police station. Of course, he done. can. He can as well. Thank he you can. very much. He can. It's a reason. If they want to charge him, if they want to charge him. But in this case, I don't think police want to charge anybody yes, around him. You well, see, I good. think all this talk about uh, tampering with evidence, moving evidence, it came after Baba said he knew from the beginning, from the onset. Uh, I mean, he didn't say directly, but from what he said, people deduced that he knew from the beginning when he went upstairs that this boy has been killed in this house. So people are now saying if you know a crime has been committed immediately there, you are not under any compulsion to move the body. You could say, okay, we'll have a meeting, we'll arrange barrier, what do we do now? Even though you know you want to go and report to the police oh, and you are, you are in fear. You could do all that without moving the body and then you could go, you could sneak out to the police station and make your complaint that, ah, something has happened though. But I don't believe that. I don't believe Baba believed the boy was killed at that moment. He could not have that notion after, maybe after that day. He could put things together after that day and feel, oh, I think something bad happened to my boy, but not yes. at that point. Yes, it means, I based align on with you. That he expect... Carry on, I, I align with you on that line of thought. 
You know, when okay. when people are bereaved, when people are bereaved, if anyone has been bereaved to something of life before, you find out that to an extent, no matter how you are, you might be a genius. Some part of your brain will cease to work. There are certain things that comes to your mind that you just want to do now, now, now. And after that thing has been done, when you sit down, all of us, and that is why police will tell people, if you remember anything, do not hesitate to tell us. Because when you first gave your first statement, you might not remember some fighter thing that you might think they don't need. So you can call them, they will accept it as well. Baba might see it when he got back home and say, come on, this, this, this. You remember Baba also came out and said, he remember he saw a duvet with blood. You know, his mind will be playing back. So things like that could happen. But that is natural. And I don't think anybody will hold it to anybody. Wow, but thank you, Shizzy. I'm sorry, thank you, Shizzy. Um, I just, can, I, I'm sorry, can I just quickly add this? Can I just quickly add this? All right, That's why add we this. also heard, you remember he said he locked, they locked, he locked the bedroom. That was the crime scene. That room was locked up by him so that hopefully the police will come there and do their job. But they refused. They failed. No, you should no, not. He, we're, we're going back, he, he locked up the bedroom where the, the question that was again. the crime scene. Hold on, hold on. Uh, no, no, no. We are going back, we're going with back the again. Because if you are saying well, Baba knew let what us he was doing, let's just deal with the matter. Yes, so Mr. Mayor, let me quickly say my. You said, you know, I am. You said that um, but if Baba knew, like I like said, that he knew on set because he went upstairs. That is, and if he moved the body, that can be a crime. Now. But will me also know why would I say why did I say that? If she doesn't know, if she feels that the death was natural, why did she now say Baba should go and do go and avenge his death? So definitely she know Mo was killed, was spied to, and she moved the body too. Before Baba did. So they both have the like so I just want us to be balancing things here. Yes, Baba, if Baba knew and he did is a crime, fine. But she is aware too, because if she's not, if she's a natural dead, if my father and uncle are meeting me now, I will say, ah, he just slept though and he didn't wake up. That is natural. For me to say go and avenge his death, definitely I knew. Yeah, but there are some crimes you can't prove. If it's uh, no, we're not diabolical. talking about proof, yes, sir. If well, it's I'm just talking about the intent there's of nothing what you she know. can do at that point. It's only a lot of we know normally so at that point. No, that's not my point. My point is he, she had that notion to that. He was yes, spied. She, he, yeah, she believed he, he, he was spied, but not something they can easily prove like that with, uh, what's it called, within the law, straight. He believes the only way, or maybe for her, she believes the only thing she can do that time is just to get... No, I'm Fast not talking justice. about the avenging. So, I'm so she about... believes. So she believes he was killed, and she was cooking uh, uh, fried rice, and she didn't hear any noise. I don't understand. No, no this I is even my point. Lawyer, lawyer, lawyer of TikTok. This is my.